Young Leader Summit is the primary leadership development program of Young People's Ministries for the Central Conferences. We have gathered here in Baguio City the young leaders from all over the Philippines and also we have invited le young leaders from Laos, Cambodia, Thailand, Vietnam, and Mongolia. Much of leadership development comes from a Western perspective, either from the U.S. or Western Europe, that helps young people adopt leadership styles that aren't their own. So what we try to do in the Young Leader Summits is to provide the structure that allows young people to discover their own leadership styles based on the context where they're doing ministry. What I love about being in the YLS is that it provided us an avenue young lead for young leaders like me um, to, to connect and to share my aspirations and experiences to other young leaders not only in the Philippines but all throughout um, the Asia. This is an amazing program and Young Leader Summit are really helping change the lives of young leaders of the United Methodist Church. And in turn, they are able to create a positive impact on the church in their culture, in their communities, and eventually in their world. I na tutunan ko dito kung paano gumawa ng programa ng maayos at tutunan ko rito na ang bawat <clears throat> ang bawat kabataan o ang bawat tao ay may kanya-kanyang ginagampanan at dapat lagi nang iniibabaw yung relationship natin sa isa't isa kasi kung wala tayong relationship uh, hindi tayo makakalikha o hindi tayo makakapag-disciples ng mga tao actually empowered and inspired to share the things that I have learned here to to remind my co-young people that um, we have always to be reminded that here as young people we are not we are not just implementing programs we are, we are not just doing this um, CIs, SIs, leadership trainings and such just to make a program for the United Methodist Church for reports but actually to do that mission and to achieve the vision. Discipleship is relational. I am into campus ministry. What it saddens me that with my co-workmates or teammates, I can't relate well. I don't have that deep relationship. But God said, no anak, you have to have a real relationship with them. But you are also leaders of a global church. And it's important to remember that you are a part of something that's making a difference in the whole world. So even as we make disciples, as we work together to do that, we are transforming the world here and across the world. 